From the Second Street Dreams Audio Network, this is Staccato, quick notes dotting the classical music landscape. I'm Jutland Gibson. 20 years ago, Forklift Dance Works premiered In Case of Fire. Just a month after the horror of 9-11. Alison Orr, founder and artistic director of Forklift Dance Works, used her skills to highlight the working folks, starting with the fire department in a piece called In Case of Fire. I had a friend who was a firefighter and we were having a casual conversation over chips and queso. And, uh, and I told them about how I had shadowed maintenance men when I was in graduate school and um, worked with them to create a series of dances. And he said, well, why don't you do that with the fire department? A year or so later, we, uh, we uh, produced In Case of Fire, uh, an, e an afternoon of dance. And Forklift Dance Works has been going ever since. Houston Tillotson and their baseball program and did play ball down field, forestry and did a project called the Trees of Go Valley, solo symphony with Peter Bay. And then we did Power Up with Austin Energy that Peter Bay conducted. And let's not forget the Trash Project. After a while, Others around the country started asking her to show them how she developed what she calls community-based dance making. Now she's celebrating the 20th year of Forklift Dance Works. She's calling it the Platinum Party. We're gonna be at the Umlauf and we're gonna be totally outside and we're gonna, uh, we are gonna be honoring um, five of our past projects, the gondola, Project. We're gonna have stops or stations for these projects where you'll get to, as an audience, as a guest, get to have some interactive experience and also some themed food and drinks. So we're gonna have um, a fire truck. We're gonna get to get a close up look at a fire truck with some firefighters. We're gonna have some energy equipment with Austin Energy. We're gonna have a performance by forestry staff in the trees. Yeah, we're gonna have um, a pitching booth where you get to measure your pitching speed with some of the Houston Tillotson players and the Texas Playboys, the Sandlot baseball team that supports us. And we're gonna have, you're gonna get to be your own lifeguard, get to get your Baywatch vibe on and, and get in the lifeguard stand with the aquatics, with our aquatics collaborators. And then we're gonna have, um, of course, a, a culminating dance party. I'm sure this is like asking you which child is your favorite. What's your favorite project that oh, you've God, done? <gasps> oh, <sighs> there is no way that I could pick one. I mean, they're all different and they're all been challenging in their own ways. I mean, I will just say, um, gosh, I don't, I was gonna say, I mean, the trash project, like I said, changed everything. Um, but you know, in case of fire, that they took such a risk, and it, it really, uh, like I said, I never thought I'd have another idea as good as that one. I mean, and then Power Up, oh my gosh, that was extraordinary. It was just amazing, the scale there. Um, I mean, the, I, don't, I don't know if I could pick. I mean, they, they all have had moments that have been unforgettable. You can see many of the projects on the Forklift Dance Works website. Links are right here on SecondStreetDreams.com. That's Staccato. I'm Judlin Gibson on the Second Street Dreams Audio Network on SecondStreetDreams.com.